AK Geeks. Hey everybody, welcome to AK Geeks Movie Review. I'm Sean. This week uh, I am reviewing the movie Sausage Party. This is spoiler free, so enjoy. To start off, this movie is produced by, executive produced by, uh, written by, screenplay written by, story done by uh, Evan Goldberg, Seth Rogen. Um, they just do everything. They're a partner, they're a team. They do really good work. But the film is directed by Greg Tiernan and Conrad Vernon. Um, but even then, this film has a lot of Seth Rogen's humor, Evan Goldberg's humor, and and that whole type, that genre that that they do, that comedy genre, it's it's in here. Their fingers are all over this. So to start off with this film, I went in expecting more of what I like because I like their type of movies. One of my favorite comedies is 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 uh, Pineapple Express, uh, and again made by those people. Or this is the end. Um, you know stuff like that. It's it's they do have a really good taste for comedy at least they appeal to me So I went in uh, high hopes for this one uh, I thought it was gonna be different and it was gonna be a little weird of, of course because it's animated It's something they haven't done before and it's it's literally it's very creative in the sense that they're trying To go a different route. I went into this film and the it started off and it, it started off trying to be it seemed trying to be cheesy trying to hit that cheesy note and I think it was done on purpose they 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 do it with song and dance and type of type of things and it seems like it's it's a thought-out process of why they're doing this this will help expand the story later on and things of that nature so there's a rhyme and a reason for this cheesiness at the get-go I did feel that the first part of the movie the first act was a little slow there were some good jokes in there I've let it stew in my head for a day it's um, it started to kick in like some of the jokes, some of the stuff that's in the background of the film and you catch the names of, of everybody they introduce in, in the film and you just kind of see what's going on here. But it was a little slow, but it's starting to kick in now. Um, second act of the film got a little bit even better, a little faster, a little bit more story, a little bit better jokes it seemed. It seemed like the maybe it was my connection with the characters was growing, I think, and uh, that why, that's why possibly the jokes hit a little better. Um, you have an adventure that you're starting to go on in the second act and then finally in the third act for me the third act was the best act of the film it was the crescendo of the film and not only was there a crescendo um, and I'm probably saying that wrong but <laughs> after that after that that peak moment in the film there's still more to it after that that is it kind of blows your mind with what they're doing that if this was not a movie about food and condiments <laughs> and uh, non-perishables and things of that nature, uh, this movie would not make the R rating that it got. Um, I did watch an interview before this film when uh, Seth Rogen was on Any Given Wednesday with Bill Simmons last week, and he said that they literally cut out like a second of film, a second of footage to get the R rating. So um, when you're watching this film, you're seeing a lot. And I think they're able to get away with a lot because of it being food and condiments and whatnot. So. I, I gotta say, like, that third act for me was just balls to the wall. I was rolling for whatever how long that, that third act was. The whole movie was, I think, a mi an hour and uh, 30, an hour and 39 minutes. So for that last third act, what are the 20 minutes, 30 minutes, I was just rolling. I had a great time with that third act. It was, it was just like a mountain, you know, the movie kept on continually going up. He ended with a great fashion. I'm really excited and looking forward to this movie when it comes out on Blu-ray and DVD to see if they have any uh, deleted scenes or any extra um, kind of gag reels, maybe showing them in the booth, just going over like uh, improving some lines. Um, I definitely am looking forward to that stuff. This movie was de a genuine, genuine like for me. It's getting uh, actually pretty good critic reviews. Uh, before I went to go watch the movie uh, yesterday on Sunday, it was I think at 83 on Rotten Tomatoes. It's got a B cinema score. It's actually doing pretty good. So for the fact that they're being super creative doing this type of movie that you don't see very often, you know, thumbs up to them. I enjoyed it myself. I definitely recommend adults. Adults go in to see this. Do not take your kids. Please don't take your kids. I saw kids in the theater that I was at. This is not a movie for kids. And if I swear, if you, you take your kids and you're like taking a nine-year-old to this movie, you have issues as a parent. I'm sorry, I'm not even gonna filter that. I'm not gonna cut that out either. You have issues as a parent if you're taking your 10 or nine-year-old or younger to this movie. Go with friends, you'll have a blast. Go with other, you know, adults. Go see this film. It's funny, you'll laugh your, you'll laugh your, your socks off. 
and I, it's, it was just a good time. I really enjoyed it. All right, guys. So uh, again, this was a non-spoiler, spoiler-free video. Hopefully, we'll be able to do a group discussion on Sausage Party either uh, later on this week. But in the meantime, you guys go check out our podcast, our weekly podcast. That's on uh, iTunes, Google Play, iHeartRadio, the AK Geeks Weekly Podcast. It's a, it's an awesome. It's a blast. It's awesome time. Um, go check that out. Also, if you can, go check out our Facebook, our Twitch, our Twitter. Um, if, since you're here, uh, you know, subscribe and everything to our channel. But for this video, you guys, uh, that's it for today. Remember to click the like, share, subscribe buttons down below. Leave your comments, questions, suggestions in the comment section. Let's have a great conversation about Sausage Party. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace. Okay, geeks.